My name is Julio, and today I'm going to be showing you how to sign up your organization for On AI Tutor. So let's jump straight in. To do so, we go ahead and click Get Started. Um, we navigate to I'm a Teacher, and here we fill in our Head Teacher account. So I will do so using myself. I will set a password. The password has to be more than 10 characters. I'll set the name of my organization. The exam board. I will accept the terms and conditions. I'm going to set an email that hasn't been used before, as I've done this a lot. So I will call it plus. I will add a plus and demo teacher one. And I will go ahead and sign up. Now, I just clicked it. It will take a second to load and save that and I am in the dashboard now nothing set up uh, so we can't see any teachers or classes or homework so it's all gonna be empty so let's navigate over to the admin account to start adding our teachers and students first off let's add some teachers so here's mr. Julia Pizzuti myself uh, I will go ahead and add one more teacher um, I will simply Put in the details here, um, and I will call it Mr. Sam Williams. Um, I'm still wanted to go to me, so I'm just going to put this demo teacher two. Um, but uh, this will send an email to uh, this email here, uh, which should be of Sam Williams's email, and there will be an invite link where the teacher can click the link, uh, set a new password, and they will have an account up and running. So let's send the invite, and that will send the message, the email. So great, you can just click away. Let me refresh. You'll have to refresh on this page to see your changes. And here we have two teachers. Fantastic. Let's start to add some classes. Now, why are classes important? Classes help group your students um, and they also are used for assigning homework. You assign homeworks to a class. So I recommend that we first create a class with all students where we have Mathematics A2 and we can select maybe all our teachers to be in this class. We save. We refresh or command R or control R to refresh um, and we have our class here now we can start to add students into this class so we click the add button here and we can go ahead and add the students manually or if you have a CSV file you can upload that CSV now we provide example CSVs of what the format needs to be. So I recommend you first download this CSV, this CSV, which looks like this. This is the CSV downloaded. I have already updated the emails um, for my case, but it's very simple. You just need columns, first name, last name, and email. No spaces between them. And then the data. So we can simply go to upload CSV, I will need to export that as a CSV. So let me save this. Export to CSV. Save. Export. I will go ahead and upload it. And it will just pre fill the values here. Now, from here, um, I can go ahead and send the invites. And you have to make sure that these emails are unique. If they are not, then either contact support to change um, or give them a separate email or do the add the plus uh, like I'm doing. It will still go to that email. Great free, free emails were sent successfully. Go ahead and refresh again with Command R. And they, here are all my students. Now, these students will have received an email invite. And I can show you what that email invite looks like right here. So this is the 
email invite. They can accept the invitation, which again enables them to set a password for the first time. And they are in. This is for Patrick. He is available. He's, he has the option to now practice and do and use the entire AI Tutor platform. So let's go back to the teacher uh, side of things. At this point, uh, you can start to add more classes. We can add top set for uh, a specific module you want. Uh, let's say higher. And add just Mr. Williams um, as the teacher. Save that. Now Mr. Williams will be able to view that, that class um, and set homework to that class. Um, you can add students into this class, but you don't want to reinvite the students. So to simply move students around, we go to a specific student, click on them, and you can change all the classes that they're in. You can remove a class and add to another class. Click Save. And if we refresh, they will be moved into that class. If a student has no class, and refresh, we will see them in students without a class. So you always know someone is assigned a class. Lastly, if a student comes to you and they have forgotten their password, no worries because you can just click on them and set them a new password right here. You can set them a password click save, tell them their password, and they will be able to log in again. So that is teacher management. Um, I recommend you get this all set up. And then if you would like to remove all the restrictions from the free tier of this platform, then you have to contact us and we can upgrade your account. Um, and we you can purchase a yearly license or two-year license for 20 students or 100 students and uh, we can discuss the details um, via email or our support line. By upgrading you will have um, you will allow all your students to be premium students automatically which means they have unlimited questions um, all the premium lessons um, with hundreds of videos, uh, limited exams, and they will have you know, no restrictions on the entire AI Tutor platform. Otherwise, uh, yourselves and your students are capped on the free tier, which restricts the number of questions and restricts uh, the number of videos that you can watch. Now, we will have further lessons that will go through um, each of these sections, more, uh, more importantly, we'll go through the dashboard uh, that will highlight everything that's happening, uh, the study section, which pretty much allows you to view uh, what we offer and the different modules that we have, along with um, the classes that you're viewing it as, so it's averaging their scores. The homework, which is the ability to set homework to a class or multiple classes, uh, very useful. The syllabus, which is to allow you to explore um, what we offer and all the questions that we have. Um, this is also available for uh, students as well. Exams, so the ability for students and teachers to practice an exam in the module that you have selected. Uh, and that is it. And we are back to admin. Thank you very much. If you have any questions, then don't hesitate to contact us uh, via our support or via our email uh, or email me directly at julio at aitutor.co.uk. This is a beta release, so uh, we are still um, fixing and uh, doing some improvements and gathering feedback. So um, there might be some issues. Do let us know if you have any problems, uh, but hopefully this should be everything to get you up and running efficiently and smoothly. Thanks very much. See you next time.